If you're looking for a quick and simple way to track your users in your bubble apps, to track their events, to get basic analytic data about the actions they're taking in your app, then uh, I wholeheartedly recommend Logsnag. And I'm gonna show you in this quick video how you can integrate it in with your bubble app and start sending events that your users take into Logsnag. Um, so uh, let's start off with a blank page here. And all we're gonna do for now is track a simple button press. Uh, so I'll call this button press this button. And then I uh, go to plugins and um, I add in the log snag plugin. Uh, and I think I'll use this one here. Um, now you can integrate in with the API connector, um, but uh, they, they've provided the plugin for you. So we're going to do it the quick and easy way. Um, and you can see here that the plugin provides actions. You can send an event or an insight. We're just focusing on events for now, such as user has clicked this button. Um, I then go into my log uh, snag account and uh, copy my API key. And uh, let's set up the workflow. So when this button is clicked, uh, I want to, where's log snag, is it in here? Log snag, send events, uh, it's log snag, there we go. So I have to choose a project, and if I go into my account, you can see I, I've got a project here, uh, so PNC hyphen demo. I then have to choose a channel, and that's just basically a way of grouping together um, your events. So I've got a channel here of user clicks button. Uh, and uh, then I need an event, and let's just check to see if in the documentation what exactly do I do with events. Uh, so I can just name it whatever I want. Uh, so I'll just call it um, user clicked um, special button. Uh, here is a description. Um, right, I think that's what I need to do. So I can hit preview. And then if I press the button. And I go into log snag, we can see that the user has uh, clicked the button and it's now recorded in this uh, channel here. Um, so if I was to click it again, we see that it appears again. Now you can send all sorts of different types of data here. If you want to create like a, an aggregation or a, or a count or something, you can use insights. Um, they, uh, you can combine that with charts. Uh, I think that this is a fantastic product because it's so neatly laid out um, and just gets you those basic and simple analytics. Um, something that is also really cool to point out is that you can um, check notify and then you can download the log snag app onto your phone if you want to receive a notification a push notification when the user takes an action in your app so there you have it a really quick way and simple way to add uh, event tracking into your app uh, i know that there's a, a whole suite of other tools out there uh, to be honest um, they've got very complicated apis they might be a bit overkill uh, for an mvp this is the uh, event tracking tool I'd recommend for an MVP. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, if you want a little bit of one-to-one -one help, uh, you can reach out to us through our website.